Volkswagen has a long and well-regarded history in this niche. Aside from the previous Golf R, this car's other obvious antecedents are two generations of R32, models that cemented the range topper's use of all-wheel drive. They were both powered by six-cylinder engines, a leftover from the front-drive VR6, which were a big capacity solution to the MK3's weight problem. Given the car's current identity, it's worth mentioning that the left-hand drive only MK2 Rai edition, with a supercharged 1.8 and 4-wheel drive, also makes an appropriate 4-runner. The GTI may get all the limelight, but for almost as long as that model has been around, VW has conceived of something like the R to outrank it. This senior model is not intended as some roughshod tear away, either. Having 4-wheel drive, brimming with kit and being both styled with restraint and knowingly expensive, the R is once again intended for grown-ups. But is it overly mature or modestly brilliant? We'll know soon enough. It wasn't enough just to review the Golf R on its own, we have also pitched it against its stiffest rivals, including a blast across Valencia against the Ford Focus RS, a triple header with the last generation Honda Civic Type R and Renault Sport Megane 275 trophy, and an estate battle royale between the Golf R Estate and the rapid Audi RS4 Avant.